Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is our second video. And today I'm going to show you something super powerful. We'll be setting up Olama, which lets you run AI models like DeepSeek, Lama, and other powerful AI models completely offline on your computer. No internet needed once installed. So let's get started. Make sure you watch till the end because I'll also share the system requirements for each model and how to choose the right one for your PC. So first, what exactly is Olama? Olama is a lightweight local AI runtime that lets you download, manage and run large language models directly on your computer. Think of it as your offline chat GPT, but running entirely from your CPU or GPU. All right, let's download Olama. Just open your browser and go to olama.com. Now click on the download button, which is in the top right corner. Here you'll see download options for Windows, Mac OS and Linux. I'm using Windows, so I'll click on download for Windows. As you can see, the downloading is started. The size of the setup is 1.1 gigabytes, which will take better internet for downloading fastly. So make sure you are in the right position and let the download to complete. The setup is now downloaded. Now, just go to your file explorer and go to your downloads folder to locate that file and then open it by double clicking on the setup or you can right click and then open to complete the installation. Wait for the installation to complete and after installation, it will automatically open the Olama interface for you. Olama comes with a built-in model library. Here you can see various models including the cloud models which will need internet to interact with them and also the local LLM models that you can install and then use offline without need of internet. So let's start with one of the trending models, DeepSeeker 18P. First select the model from the library and then send a high message from the input field and as you can see Olama will automatically start downloading the model. Depending on your internet speed, it might take a few minutes since it's a large model. So let the system to download the model and you can rest till then or better subscribe the channel and also leave a like. Once it is downloaded, it will start responding to your already sent message. DeepSeek R1 is a reasoning model, so it will think and give the reasoning for large durations and then present you with the answer and it is a large language model which is trained on 8 billion parameters. So the outputs are pretty much considerable. Alright, it's time to see how this AI handles a core front-end development task. We're going to give it a single prompt to build a complete login form from scratch. Let's dive in and see how clean and functional its HTML and CSS really are. As you can see, it has generated the code for us. Which seems nice, but now let's see how it looks. Let's copy the code, then open the VS Code IDE and paste the code there. And click on Go Live and see the preview. It looks nice. The output is much better and yes, it is little interactive also. Alright, so now that we've successfully installed and tested DeepSeek R1, let's move on to another very popular open source model. El Lama 2. 7B by Meta. This model is known for being fast, efficient, and quite good at general purpose chat, writing, coding, and reasoning tasks. It's a perfect next step if you want something lightweight, but still powerful. We will be downloading the Llama 2 model using our Windows terminal, and also we will be seeing how to interact with the terminal. So to install it, first you need to go to the Llama platform, again, Search for the exact model named Llama2 and then click and open it. Then you will see the different models of Llama2. So now I am going to click on the second one, which is the Llama2 colon 7b. Now copy the command and then search for the command prompt and open it. Paste the copied command there and press enter and then it will start pulling the model from the Llama platform. Wait for it to download. This is also a big model and it is about 5 gigabytes in size. So you will again need a strong internet connection to download it fastly. Till then, again, you can go and subscribe our channel and make sure to like as well. 
After downloading is finished, it will show you a success message as shown on the screen. And once it is ready, you'll see the terminal waiting for your prompt. You can simply type out your prompts and interact with the models without needing an internet connection. Let's ask it by giving it a prompt, where we will be asking, what you can do for me, tell me in our summarized way. And let's see how it responds. Of course, it replied to use very well. And yes, it is what it is, the local LLM models. You can access all the local models installed on your PC in the terminal and the UI interface of the Olama as well, which is super cool. Lastly, to check all the local models installed on your computer, just go to the command prompt and then type Olama list as shown on the screen. And then it will show you the list of all LLM models installed on your computer. Also, if you want to run the models again, just type the command Olama run and the model's name onwards as shown in the video. You can simply close the chat or the model by just clicking Ctrl plus D on your keyboard or you can ask slow simply type slash by which closes the chat. And a quick note before we wrap up, while my internet was on during this recording, the models we used can run completely offline. I encourage you to try it yourself and let me know how it goes in the comments. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, you know how to reach me. I've put all the links for the platform along with the commands we used in the description below. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.